Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're diving into comparison up to exciting operating systems, White OS versus Chrome OS. Whether you're looking for a new OS or just curious about these alternatives, you've come to the right place. If you want to host your own website, you can try hosting. Link will be given in the description. Let's start with FireOS. It's an open source operating system based on Chromium OS, the same foundation behind Chrome OS. But what makes FireOS different and why might you choose it over the more well known Chrome OS? Let's break it down. FireOS gives you some extra features and flexibilities that Chrome OS isn't. It's highly customizable, perfect for those who like to tweak the systems, whether it's adjusting the user interface or adding additional functions. FireOS lets you have more control over your OS experience. Now to Chrome OS. This is Google's official operating system, mainly designed for Chromebox. Chrome OS is all about simplicity, speed, and security, offering a streamlined experience centered around the Chrome browser. It's ideal for users deeply embedded in Google ecosystem. But is it the best fit for everyone? While both FireOS and Chrome OS share similar foundation, the user experience are quite different. Chrome OS offers a straightforward and user-friendly interface, making it ideal for those who want an easy and no first experience. FireOS, on the other hand, gives you more room to personalize your system. Your decision will ultimately depend on how much control you want over your OS. Now let's highlight the key advantages of FireOS. Installing FireOS is a breeze compared to Chrome OS. Unlike Chrome OS, FireOS doesn't need third-party software for dual booting. It can boot independently, give you a smooth experience. You can easily access other drives on a PC. It's similar to how you would access drives on a Windows, even in a dual boot setup. Plus, you can install FireOS on a virtual box with poor Play Store support. In contrast, Chrome OS has a separate version for virtual machines, but without Play Store access. Now, let's shift gears to Chrome OS and its benefits. Being Google's mainline OS, Chrome OS gets early and consistent updates so you're always running a latest version. Chrome OS is polished, stable, and ideal for users who prioritize a seamless, dependable experience. While FireOS offers flexibility, Chrome OS is perfect for those who value stability and don't need all the custom options. Despite of the differences, FireOS and Chrome OS share some common features. Both support sideloading APKs from third-party sources. Both offer access to Google Play Store apps, giving you a wide range of variety of applications to choose from. The user interface and the core functionalities are quite similar, so you will find a consistent experience no matter which you choose. Chrome OS only supports devices with Intel 8th generation processors and newer or Ryzen series processors. However, FireOS is much more versatile, offering support per processor as far back as 2011, covering a wide range of both older and newer hardware. When it comes to app support, Chrome OS has an edge with a seamless access to Google Play Store and full compatibility with Android apps. While FireOS can support these apps too, it might require extra steps to get certain apps running since it's open source. Both systems focus on security, but Chrome OS benefits from Google's robust security infrastructure and gets quick, seamless updates to get it protected. On the other hand, FireOS being open source may follow a different update cycle. So if security and automatic updates are top priorities for you, this is something to consider. In the end, choosing between FireOS and Chrome OS depends on your preference and needs. If you love customization and control, then FireOS is your go to. If you want a fast, simple, and fully integrated experience with Google services, Chrome OS is the right fit for you. What's your take on FireOS versus Chrome OS? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to hit the thumbs up if this video helps you out. Subscribe for more tech insights and I will see you in the next one. Until then, happy exploring!